really on it, really on it. Consequences getting real, but we still be on it. Tell no lies, tell the truth, shame the devil. Tell no lies, tell the truth, shame the devil. Yeah, I'm really Revelation 12 11. Really and they overcame really him by the blood of the Lamb and by the word real, of their but we testimony. Still be on it. Tell no lies, tell the truth, shame the devil. Tell no lies, tell the truth. Yeah. Spark a flame today in the hearts of others by sharing your testimony, the gospel, the good news. Revelation 12 11, and they overcame him by the blood of the lamb and by the word of their testimony. <clears throat> Well, praise the Most High today, family. Hallelujah today. Family, it is another absolutely gorgeous day here in the Carolinas, and we're so glad to see it. I do hope everyone is well, and that you're able, like myself, to get out and enjoy it. Getting yourself in some fresh air. Some sunshine. And the Most High will is some good exercise. Some of that cooling water, that cooling water. Family, we do have an absolutely important idea to share today. And the Most High has really been dealing with me about taking this um this channel to the next level. But I've been patiently praying and seek, seeking wise counsel to um do things the right way. But it's, the idea today is called On Blast. Tell the truth, shame the devil. Praise the Most High. And what that means, family, is what we find in Revelations 12 and 11. It says, and they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of their testimony. And it goes on to say they um, didn't care about their life to the point of death. Pardon me, I didn't write that part down. But family, what this short video is about today is it's an opportunity for you to tell your testimony. Because I've been getting comments back from my um my ox. And I want to give them a shout. Our ox Charles, our ox Invisible Brother, and our ox Special Forces. They've been really encouraging your brother keeping him up and um just like Moshe had his arms held up to fight his his battles these ox have really been holding my arms up to do what I need to do so encouraging and um each one of them have, have each one of them have shared a part of their testimony with me and um the Most High has been really encouraging me to take this platform, the um, channel that we have, to another level where that's what we do. We tell our testimony. We share our testimonies. So, I'm putting out the call today that if you would like to come on and share your testimony, reach out to me. And the information is right here. And what we're going to do is we're going to... Um, I was one of the, the first ones, I think I was 15, number 15, over there at Tayo Ministries to give my testimony. And I think that's how we want to do it. And then what we'll do is um, take the people that um, have shared their testimony and then have a live interview with them or chat here on the, um, the channel and actually share their testimony live and in living color but first share your testimonies and it's going to be the same format as our arts over there at Tao Ministries did just send your testimony in an email over to this, this email right here and um We'll put them up on on the um on our channel, and of course I'll watch them and, and make sure everything is up to par. 
but I think the, the, the time limit was five to ten minutes. Hey, hey, but hey, we'll say hey, about ten minutes hey, to send your testimony. Hey, and then hey, once you send that, we'll um I'll get back in touch with you and, and we'll um seek out a time to share your whole testimony or give you a whole show to, to share your testimony. And this is important, fellas, because I'm saying I can't do it by myself. And I can only tell my testimony so much. And not that it don't help because we're getting new subscribers daily. All praises to the highest. But however, it, it's, it's what they say. The teamwork makes the dream work. And we're here fulfilling the most highest plan and will for, will for our lives. So if the, the thief has come to steal, kill, and destroy, but we're putting them on blast today, family, saying no. This is how the devil works. You don't have to be tricked by that. All you need to do is do what I'm doing, do what I did. Call on the name of the Most High, he'll save you. And he'll clean you up. Tell the truth, shame the devil. That's what it's all about, family. And if you would like to remain anonymous, that's fine too. You don't have to show your face. Just like I told my aunt today, if he didn't want to um, show his face in the recording, <clears throat> I think it's important for all of us to at least lift up our voice. And it's, it's fine to write it down too. I believe that's okay too, but I think it's more important when you personalize. Just like I had a business, I used to go around and, um, and um, polish furniture. Like I said, I, I worked in a moving company, and I'm a, I'm a hustler by heart, family. I, I would go to these people's houses, and I'm gonna say, well, "This piece here look a little dull. You need to, you need my personal touch." <laughs> and that was my hustle, family, and, and that's what we need to do with our testimonies. Cause it's fine um, writing it down, but can't nobody really feel it unless they see your expressions and they hear your expressions. But that's my call. I'm, 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 I'm asking the family to reach out to me. I have over, well, we have, thank the most high, we have over 500 and 27, 20, we'll say 25 subscribers right now. And I know there's plenty more that don't have a subscribe that watch. But I will ask you to reach out to your brother and help me. <laughs> Just like my uncle told me the other day, he said, Bob, the easiest thing to do when you can't get a, 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 a good prayer out is just to ask him to help you. Say, so help me, Lord. <laughs> and he'll help you. And that's what I'm asking for today. I'm asking for your help. And for the new tools I need to um, do my work better. Pray that the most high will supply. I'm not the type of individual to ask for help for certain things. Because I've always supplied my own needs. But I'm asking for the help in this area. So I can get another um pad. Cause my eyes ain't as as good as they used to be, and I need something besides my phone to do my editing. And no, I hadn't planned on asking asking this. But I'm taking our, our work to a whole new level, family, and, and um, I would appreciate the help in doing it. Um, have in mind the, um, the tablet I want and the camera I want. So just pray for the, your brother that the most I would supply that for us to continue doing his work. And... Um, I appreciate you. And let's um, put the devil on blast. And see, this on blast is two ways, family. And see, when the Most High first gave me this idea about um, putting people and things on blast, I thought I was going to be going around 
meeting people and um, good in the hood, putting on blast what, what good they was doing in the neighborhood. And I had started it and, and ran into a church and told the people what I was doing and told them I wanted to sit down and interview him and, and um, see what good he was doing in the, in the hood. And that put my, um, put that part of our ministry on hold. But now the Most High has revamped it to the point where not only are we putting Hasatan on blast by exposing him, but we're putting the Most High on blast for the good, good things he's doing to and for us. So support your brother, family. This is my um, email address where you can send your 10 to 15 minute recordings of your testimony of how you come into the awakening, what the Most High did for you. And my testimony is, is more catered towards my um, my lifestyle in the past on the streets and how the Most High has um, gotten me over all these surgeries from the stroke I had and the um, the situations that brought along their outcome. So, however you feel led, though, don't let me um try to tell you how to tell your testimony. And this is my cash app right here. So you can send whatever you can to help your brother to purchase some new tubes to do my job better. So I won't be up all night trying to edit recordings because I can't hardly see it. Or I'm straining my eyes. But the, the text says, ask and make your request known. And um, I thank the most high for supplying. But we love you so much, family. And um, do know I'm very transparent. I won't tell who, who sent what, but I'll let you know when we got it and I'll show it to you. And that's going to be it. I ain't going to say nothing else. But I love and appreciate you so much for your support, family. And um, subscribing, liking, and sharing the recordings when you do. And more than anything else, them comments and them prayers is what get me through. Family, I'd be wrong not to share this testimony. I just um finished doing our recordings and I was... I'm going to say I was hungry and um, didn't have the food in the refrigerator like I would want to have. And, and I was praying. I said, Pop, I'm hungry. <laughs> but if I need to um, sacrifice and, and, and fast for the next few days because it being our Shabbat, I can't go out tomorrow and get nothing to eat. And family, I don't like sharing stuff like this, but I got to be obedient. I say, yes, sir. I'll um, go ahead and fast if that's what you want me to do. But family, you know when the Most High calls you to a fast. And this wasn't the case. And I had already prayed and thanked him for supplying my provisions for today. And um, I said, I'm going to let it be. So like I said, I was headed home to um, go down and lay, <laughs> go down and lay down and think about it <laughs> with a sore belly. But the most high, um, he said, um, Robert, go check your mailbox. I said, Pop, ain't nobody sending me no mail. The people that, that send me help, they send it through my cash app. He said, do what I say, go check your mail. So I jumped up to go check the mail and the face started jumping up in me for the belief in what he said to do. Family, I got there to the mailbox and there was one lonely little letter in the back of the mailbox. Where I put that em envelope? There it is. And someone had, had sent me some money. So 
so I was not only able to go get me some food, but I, I was also able to go get it before the sun went down. Praise the Most High today. Hallelujah. The Most High is good to us, family. He, he's answering our prayers. And like I said before, as soon as we get them out, the answer is right there. Like I said, family, I don't be begging nobody for nothing. I, I lean and depend on the most high. But, however, I am going through some tough times here of late with um, not being able to work. And trust me, I tried to get back out there, but the most high said, go sit back down. Him and the pain in my foot and in my shoulder. But the most high is able. And see, he was he was sharing me about that. He was like, it's not only that you're obedient for what I do to you, do for you, but you're obedient to what I won't do for you. Like I was sharing with the ark, he could have healed my shoulder instantly. He could have healed my foot instantly and gave me some new toes. But he said, nope, I'ma see if you really love me. Do you really love me? And I say, I love him today, family. I love him, I love him, I love him, I love him, I love him. Not just because he give me something to eat or he touches someone's heart to um, send me a piece of money, but because he loved me first. He did his part. He died for me, family. Mm -mm -mm. Are any of us willing to say we would do the same? But uh, family, I love you today and ask you to really ponder sharing your testimony with the world because as this, this platform grows I believe the most high is really going to grow it because that's where we get our energy and strength from the word of our testimony and the blood of the lamb we love you so much and appreciate you for tuning in and reaching out do stay up and keep pushing forward in the right direction shalom hallelujah